honestly all my life is just my dorm even if it's like i have some time i don't really have any anywhere to go anything that i had looking forward to is now gone i miss being around people like i miss being able to hug my friends when i see them like i miss being able to like invite whoever i wanted over and not worrying that they're sick We're just going to kind of go in knowing nothing, and I definitely feel like we're going to be one of the least educated classes. Um, I'm not even lying. I don't know where anything is on campus. I don't know my opportunities. I don't know the things that are available to me because we had a like online orientation. My career field is like something that's done with other people. What if next year I still can't work on films? And the idea of like next semester might be the same. Do I stay home with my parents again? Or am I wasting money? Is this stupid? I just don't really feel like what we're paying for is what we're getting. I do know that like the, the gym's open and there's Sanger still, but not really. I don't feel like I'm getting what everyone said is like, what starts here like changes the world. And I feel like there's been no change. I know that like, I'm not the only one who's struggling with this. I think during my move in time, I only saw two other families because they spaced it out a lot. I know my roommate is really scared because um, she visits her family often. Uh, I need to be responsible around her as well. In general, I would have a better relationship with my sweet mates. They're super nice, just like they're at the game today. We just don't have the motivation even to log on to our computer. We don't even have to walk to class, but it's just the idea of like logging onto computer knowing that at the end of it, you'll still be confused and that the professor's not gonna like correct themselves. If I wasn't as like motivated to try my best and I didn't have goals because I'm helping pay for this on my own, I wouldn't know where to even begin in college. If I go to study with people, people are going to assume that I'm just going out, you know, and just like being unsafe when it's the only resource I have left. That's happened to me already. Like I've been studying with someone and they sent a picture to my building and our elevators got shut off because people thought we were having guests over, but I was literally just studying. I'm not here just for school. Like I'm here also to learn about myself and I really want friends. There's no organic way of making friends. I've messaged a lot of people thinking we would end up hanging out or something and then they ghost to you. I think it's putting a toll on the mental health. Kind of just how bad I've been feeling in quarantine really pushed me to like start getting meds and like kind of take a proactive approach toward my mental health. I pushed back my graduation, so I'm taking an extra semester. So hopefully it'll be better by like spring 2022. I actually have a student job on campus. Um, I work at Texas Invention Works, which is the engineering makerspace. And it's weird. Going into work with a mask is weird. Um, normally we would be packed. I would be running around helping different students. Now I'm lucky if I get to help one person over my shift. I did have a few friends that graduated this last spring and I was sad and I was like, man, I'll never see them again. Like they're just gone because of COVID and like they're going back home and whatever. And now I'm like, wait, that's going to be me with like my class of 21 friends too. Like I'm not going to see them either. <laughs> it's strange to think about my last college party was in February, you know? Um, here's my list. My friend Brandon had made a Discord server for like all of UT. It was pretty small for a while. We, over the summer, did stuff like movie nights, um, game nights. It really just provides a good place for a lot of people to kind of come together and socialize with fellow students. I think we've doubled in size since quarantine started, for sure. I would say right now it's worse coming in as a freshman because we just don't know when this is going to end. At least I've gotten 
my time at UT. I at least figured out as much as I could. Social media right now is the only way that people on campus can perceive you. There's no other way for people to know who you are because like we're online. Today we're going to be going on a walk around campus, which I have not been able to do a lot since I'm indoors a lot, but I'm excited to do that. I'm sure you've seen the fountain. The yeah. The iconic fountain where Jimmy Fallon fell in backwards. Oh yeah, that looks good. <laughs> do what? <laughs> NHB. That is where that is where you'll go. That is where you'll be. I'm just trying to like give you names of buildings so that way you'll kind of have a general idea of where things are. There's an entrance down there. I should have pointed it out that you can take to come through that way. This is where I would always eat because I just lived right on the corner over here. It's really hard for me to find friends that I feel comfortable with. So I feel like that takes me a long time. So like having the pandemic kind of stop that is a little bit, it's frustrating. And the later that becomes, the harder it is. But I guess it's been fun. I hope that like now that we're, I'm going to a second semester of that, that's going to be a lot better now too. Um, and I'm looking forward to it. My biggest goal is just to find what I have the biggest passion for and to like stick with it. I also really wanted to get a job, so I hope that like the job I chose now is the one. Those are my two main goals. And you got it, kind of. Yeah, kind of. I hope so. I do think I am feeling better. I hope I am. <laughs>